I'm Byron Abraham Daniel. I'm in the Mellon College of Science in the Physics Department. I'm from Atlanta, Georgia, the good old ATL. <laughs> My preparation process took two months. So I started back in December. And if you're wondering why this took two months, so there are a lot of things I did. So I scripted this, I made examples, I ran through examples with my family. There are times, like, I have so many drafts of my presentations just kind of like on the cutting room floor, essentially. There's one funny story that, like, during Christmas, I just walked up to my dad and said, hey, dad, can I, can I practice something with you? And he's like, sure. And I just went through my entire spill and was just getting feedback from him about it. <laughs> so uh, it was mostly just, it was a pretty long process. <laughs> okay, I will tell you the fact that got me into neutrino research to begin with, so, I was talking with a TA in my undergrad about neutrinos and she said, oh wait, let me show you something really cool. And then she just did this. And she said, oh, in that one second, a hundred billion neutrinos just went through my finger. And, I, and then I just said like, wait, wait, what? And she said, yes, a hundred billion, isn't that crazy? And I just said, yes, yes it is. Like, where do I learn about more? And she said, oh, why don't you come to our department, weekly department talks, so we're gonna learn more about neutrinos. Great hook. <laughs> <laughs> what I really like doing research at Carnegie Mellon is just like how much, just like I really like the physics part, how much emphasis they put on just understanding just all the physics and like rotations. So, for example, although I focus on neutrino physics as part of the my graduate process, they actually had me learn other try other labs too, so I could learn about other particles besides neutrinos. It's just important to make sure that we as graduate students have a great grasp of physics as a whole in addition to just our own specific subfield.